I'm Howard Hale with the Harvest USA Report. I'll be back with today's report in a moment. But right now, I'd like to talk to you about the websites that are available through Hale Broadcasting that are really great for agriculture. Cattlemanscorner.com, HarvestUSA, Report.com, Horsemanscorner.com, and AgSearch.us. They're all websites that are involved with agriculture, a good place for agricultural businesses to advertise, and a really good place for you to go to find good agricultural-based businesses. Horsemanscorner.com, Cattlemanscorner.com, HarvestUSA Report, and AgSearch.us. Steve Swaffer is the Executive Director of No-Till on the Plains. Their winter conference is on the 26th. It's virtual. But Steve says there's a good reason why more farmers are becoming interested. We've been mining our soils. So our, our native soils have lots of carbon, lots of organic matter, lots of naturally occurring both macro and micronutrients. And, and as we grow crops and we export those crops off of the farm, we're also exporting all of those valuable resources, the carbon, the, the nitrogen, the phosphorus, the potassium. And we've been replacing them with our commercial products, but uh, we're really not storing those soils back to the way they were 50 years ago. So in, instead of a mining process, we need to be adding those particular things back to the soil so that the soils can behave more naturally and, and help our crops grow. And reduce erosion? Oh, absolutely. Anytime you keep that soil aggregation, those those soil particles bound to one another and bound to their neighbor and the neighbor bound to the ba- neighbor soil particle, we're keeping that soil in place. And that's by keeping that soil covered with either a crop residue or, or something growing. Steve Swaffer, Executive Director of No-Till on the Plains. Their conference is on the 26th. Thanks for joining us. May God bless. Join us again. More time. Howard Hale.